What's up everybody? Welcome back to Trash Talk. With me, Rocky Padilla, and today, tonight we have a legend in the house. Everybody been asking for this interview. <laughs> so I'm here tonight with Thomas Teddy Corniati. How you doing, bro? What's up, bro? How you doing, man? Welcome yeah, back. Okay. Welcome, welcome to my show, man. Welcome back to LA, buddy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. question will be everybody wants to know you played the Pobatama in 94 right yeah, with, with Panacea Bandung yes yeah. how did Panacea Bandung discover you I think that time uh, in 93 uh, I was playing for ITB okay Institute Technology Bandung shout out ITB alumni 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 ITB Ganesha ITB Bandung Dago Dago oh no I never I never been there oh yeah <laughs> so yeah. you play for Maybe for how many seasons? Uh, probably about three seasons. Three seasons. Along the way, we're still playing, you know, back home, you can play pro and play college as well. But uh, that's how Panacea find, find, find me out, you know what I'm saying? So. Okay, and then you play four years in Obatama? Just four years. Four seasons. Short and simple. Short and simple. <laughs> when you won two championships and then lost twice the in the finals. Yeah, so. Well, well, we're just gonna talk about ah, the winning. We're just gonna talk about the winning. Winning. Not gonna talk winning. About the winning. So, which one is more memorable? Yeah. Uh, 94 and 97. Okay. Which one is which one is more more, more memorable for you? I think uh, boredom has a different chapter. Yeah. It's like a book. The one is that you open the book. Uh -huh. The last one you close the book. Right. The first one it was like we like underdog. Okay. Like there was like probably 12 teams. We like number 12. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Because we like, we got no, you got no, we are a new team. Oh, you we are a brand new team. Okay. Yeah, and then that that was the first time they get back with American players. Okay. So we totally completely new, and a new system as well. And then uh, we play Aspac in the final. Yes. And I was a rookie. That was my first year in Kobatama. Wow. Yeah. And my role was literally defending everybody. Yeah. <laughs> so, but uh, we we lucky to win. Aspac was a great team and uh, great ownership. The, the players and Bobby Parks, they were honest. Mm -hmm. so, you know, I think we were lucky to win the championship. It was a close game. And uh, uh, I'm humbled to have that opportunity to play for Panacea and I respect Aspac. But, so, but 97, <laughs> you got that blonde hair. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got things that, change. Things you know, change. Things change. Uh, 97, you know, after like three, four years in, in the Pro League, you work out, you're lifting weight, you got better food, you know, uh, you got the system nail down you got the football yeah. you got the dunks you know oh, yeah, yeah. So, so everything is you is, did you did, the, you did that one dunk in the finals yeah. I, I remember that yeah so so you got everything lined up you know but the first one is special because it's the beginning the, the last one is special because uh i feel like completely ready for everything because i know what's coming uh, i can i can defense i can i can play with my team better if you if you've been playing for four years together and uh, the, the American player was awesome. Of course, Ray Kelly was there. Uh, oh, Ray Kelly? Was there? Yeah, Stan Seven is there. But he got hurt. He got hurt. And then Gerald uh, McDonald. Eric Darts and Emeka uh, uh, Okenwa. Oh, play. okay. So, so we have three foreign players, one on the bench. Okay. Right? Just for practice. Ray got hurt uh, uh, like three weeks before that. Okay. So that's why we, we have Kiki and myself playing playing the guard position. I think that was funny though, because Kiki and myself, we can play both point guard and shooting guard. Okay. Kind of like nowadays NBA. Uh -huh. We did that a long time ago, guys. <laughs> it was just because the accident. We don't have the, the point guard. Okay. Ray is hurt. Right. So, so the coaching saying like, you know, let's let's put Kiki and TK together. Okay. Starting. So, so it's completely new look. New look. Yeah. But it works. It works. It was. I think it was lucky too. I just oh. being humble. Come on, man. I mean, being hard stay. work. Hard work and lucky. Stop staying. <laughs> Stop staying lucky, man. So what was yeah, the yeah. reason? I want to know. Yeah, yeah. I, I watched that game live. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. You gave me your, your wrist back. Oh, yes. I remember that? Yeah. And then... Uh, it's hard for me not to get this goal, but I wanted it. It's just the ups. 
Okay, they just walked back. Yeah, uh, right. 20 years ago, you gave me your wrist, I remember. I still have it at the at my oh, house. Oh yes, yes, yes. With the but ball, the with the ball, with the ball, one. But I, I keep, I'm, I'm still curious though. Yeah. Why did you color your hair blonde? Okay. I think that's that's the past. Before '97, before I play, uh, you know, I already, I already living in the states. Yeah. I went to school in Savannah, in Georgia. Don't say it's about you guys of Dennis Rodman. Yeah. <laughs> you know what happened is that summer, I mean that June, I think yeah. it was NBA Finals. Okay. So I was still here in the states. And Bola called me, Eko Widodo. Yeah. Eko Widodo. Shout out to Eko Widodo. What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> What's up? So what happened is um, yeah. they called me up. Hey, do you want to cover NBA with, with us? NBA Finals to Chicago and Utah. Okay. I said yes, of course. Oh, yeah, so, yeah, I saw the yeah. Oh. we flew uh, I flew from Georgia to Chicago okay. and we met up there. So we covered the NBA all games. Okay. I think it was five or six games. Okay. Something like that. And then Dennis Rodman is there. Michael Jordan, shout out. <laughs> the God. Scotty Pippen. Yeah. But it's a legendary moment. Uh, and I got inspired by Dennis Rodman, of course. So. Yes, he's for real. Because uh, he has color his hair and, and he got a spirit. And I went home to, to Indo and then it just stuck in my mind, you know, I got to do something cool. For me, playing basketball is love. Yeah. Enjoying every day, you know. Some people stress out, thinking about the game for me, it's like, let's do it now. Okay. So, and, then, and then, yes, you, did you fly back and forth? Yes, I am. During the football time season? Yes, we, we fly, I fly back and forth. Uh, Atlanta? Atlanta, right? Atlanta uh, to Bandung, to Jakarta yeah, and Bandung. Bandung. Like twice a season. Twice a season? Yeah, something like that, yeah. Well, but not too many. Yeah. Did you have to adjust uh, to the time zone? Oh, yeah, the time zone. Are, are you used to it? I, I think I got used to it. Before that, I already travel a lot. And you know me, I always try to stay in shape. Yeah, I know. I don't do all I know. The bullshit, you know. I know, I know. I, I sleep, and I wake up early in the morning until now, work out. Just remember that all the other newer players. Yeah, you stay, stay in shape, man. Yeah. Stay in shape. You gotta watch out. This guy, is, <laughs> this guy is really, really disciplined. The discipline, ah, you know. Man. Thank you, Rocky. I know, I know, I know, I know, because I know, because I'm, I'm pretty close with him back then when I was still in LA. Yes. This guy, re this guy recruited me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> to go to his team, so I know this guy work ethic. So this guy is crazy. Thank you. Man. Always wake up at five in the morning. Work and out. Work out. Running yeah. or lift weight or shoot around. So that's crazy. So. Yes, sir. So let's talk about now. You just, uh, I wouldn't say sign, uh, <laughs> but you just get, sign, got, but you get hired, the you just got hired uh, yeah. with the Clippers. LA Clippers, baby. Can you just yeah. tell? Can you just tell my viewers like okay. what, what you do for them and about your job? Yes. Because yeah. um, this is exciting. Right. But Indonesian guy working for an NBA, for team, NBA this team. This is really big. Yes. Thank, thank you. I think once again I'm lucky. I'm humble for the opportunities. About two months ago, uh, the Clippers and, and myself talked to each other and then um, they were looking for like somebody creative to take care of their branding, their design, their promo videos, the overall look of the LA Clippers. They want to elevate that. And prior to this, I worked for the NBA on TNT. Oh, yeah, yeah, Atlanta. NBA TV. Inside yeah, NBA, the NBA, right? NBA on TNT, uh, NBA TV all together, Turner okay. Sports in Atlanta. Uh -huh. So that's a big uh, experience for me, right? And before that, I was with Spectrum Sportsnet. Uh, like Lakers, Dodgers, Ellis Sparks. So that's like a good, solid six, five, six years experience. Mm -hmm. And uh, I kind of talk to the, you know, to the people that, that talk back to me and uh, decide to hire me. I think I'm humbled for the opportunities. And, and my role now is the, the executive creative director for the Clippers. Uh, my main role is taking care of the branding with the team. Yeah. Work with, uh, I'm, I'm all about team, you know, okay. teamwork. Work with different teams, put them together, make sure they're all consistent. And, and, and share all the files and work together in a creative way and also production. Video, online, digital, social media, wow. everything needs yes. to be lined up all together. Because you know what happens? The Clippers has a goal. Okay. We want to win a championship. Steve Ballard, you know, the, main, the guy, the main boss, he got a vision. Jerry, we got Jerry West too. This is dope, you know? So it's, it's two, two major leadership. And Doug Rivers, as well as the head coach, has a championship uh, experience in Boston. So we got the whole the whole leadership. We just need to find a way to, to get better. This season we have so many injuries, as you know. I know. I'm a big Clipper fan. Yeah, it's, it's like, for, everybody, you know, for everybody that doesn't know, yeah, I'm a very big Clipper fan. It's kind fans. of misfortune, you know. It, it, things happen in basketball. That's why you gotta stay in shape. Yes, oh, that's serious. true. Stay in shape, man. <laughs> stay away from injuries. <laughs> so hopefully, you know, uh, we can turn this back around. We okay. promise you. I, I work hard uh, on and off the court. I know. And I work hard with the team. I think all the people's organization working hard to, to achieve that goal. 
to bring a championship to, to, to the oh. Clippers, to LA. Oh, hopefully also, that's in the next couple of years, you never know. We will work hard. Hopefully. Yeah. Promise you. Uh, thank LAC, you, baby. Thank you, DK. Yeah, thanks, Rocky, for everything. Man. For the yeah. Thank you for Give me a shout out real quick to all Indonesian basketball family, uh, IBL, uh, all the other Kubatama, the fans, uh, the other teams, coaches, uh, ownership. Uh, uh, shout everybody. You shout everybody, you know, and, and I love you all. Uh, keep it up. Keep up the good work. The great work. National team, shout out. Shout out to everybody over there, men and women's national team. Keep it up, hopefully good luck with uh, Asian game next year. Asian game next year. Next year? Next year? In 10 months. 10 months, good luck with that. And then SEA Games. And Sorry, and in 9 months. 9 months. In August. Yes, in August. Go Indonesia, go IBL. And thanks Rocky for everything. Thank you You're too. the man. <laughs> I wish, I wish. Well, keep it up. Bro. Thank you, job, appreciate bro. it. Yeah, of course. And if you want to follow TK oh, yes. on Instagram, follow TK app. TK7 Live on Instagram. And make sure to follow LA Clippers too, right? LA Clippers. At LA Clippers. So, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to give me a like for this video. Like this video. It's dope. <laughs> dope video, my thank friend. Thank you. Thank you. And then uh, comment if you miss TK. <laughs> and <laughs> anything about TK, if you have any memories with TK, just yes. comment in the video. Yeah, you want, yeah, because you want to check out basketball, uh, shoes. Let me check it out. You can't, they can't see it, but they can't see you guys. Take it there out. You he's taking out his shoes. You like sneakers? Check out my YouTube as well. Oh, yeah, Ticket Seven YouTube. Live. Yeah, you guys YouTube, Instagram, Facebook, all Ticket Seven Live. So, shoes, uh, lifestyle, basketball, workout. Workout. Uh, you got everything. Workout? Yeah. Got yeah, of course, man. Plyometrics. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. So make everything. sure you subscribe. Yeah. Make sure you subscribe to his yeah, channel. Subscribe too. each other. <laughs> yeah, subscribe each other. Yeah. So thank you guys Thanks for watching for again, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Thank you very much. I'll